What is going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm gonna be taking you on an updated gym tour to show you what my current setup is at the moment. After that, I'm back at it again, building another piece of gym equipment, a chest supported back row machine facing one direction, a chest pressing machine facing the other. From there, we're gonna go ahead and do some heavy back training, talk goals, all that and more. Let's get into it. So I was able to get what I needed in terms of hardware. There's still a couple things that I know that I'm gonna have to go back for. One of those things being one of these. We need we need a flange, one and a half inch flange. We need two of them actually. All right, so this is what six foot is gonna look like. How much space? So this is gonna take up a fair chunk of room. First three cuts, four cuts are gonna be six feet, two feet, two feet, and two feet. And from there, I need to do some analyzing on how that matches up with my body mechanics to decide what, what the measurements are for some of the next pieces. We have five four by four posts. This is basically the best that Home Depot has to offer. And one two by four if I need. Another one though, I know I have a few in stock. All right, let's get to work, let's do some cutting. Hello, 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 Stefan, hello. Hello, 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 hello. This is the worker. The most expensive ones. I thought it was good now. Uh, mini pies, one after another now. One of the two. I heard he's a very strong guy, but... My prediction with the Gennady. Prediction with the Gennady. Bogdan Stoika. This 18 inch piece, we're gonna facet this 12 inch 2x4 to the end of this, and then you fasten the 2x4 to this, and that's how it keeps it to the frame, and that's kind of the frame of our seat. To create the seat, you wanna take 12 inch 2x6, 12 inch 2x6, 12 inch 2x4. Thank you. 
so far. And what I was able to do is cut every piece of wood, at least that my original plan had indicated that I needed to cut. I have everything cut down to spec. It's a matter of sanding each piece. I gotta sand each piece of wood and then start reassembling everything back into place. Probably have to do a little bit of re-engineering on some things, specifically where the pivot points on the arms are gonna be. Uh, but outside of that, I know where the framing is going to look like. I know where most things are going to look like. So it's a matter of putting it all together. Got to get her done. Not a bad job about documenting things here. We are about 90% finished the project. It's kind of finishing up the final touches, aligning things correctly, making sure everything runs as smoothly as possible. Gonna measure six inches down, get a little hole, a little pilot hole. And I am just 
Sweaty, sweaty, Betty. Gats are changed. Quick links. Wonder why he's got an apartment and he's a goddamn celebrity who's like our version of Tom Brady in that country right now. He's like, before he beat anybody, he was already talking about smacking me, then John, then Devin, then maybe Lil Nas. Okay, so we just got the first, first layer, now we're gonna do the same thing to the back here. pads it's not beautiful but you know what it works it's functional as fuck that's all I'm mad is up in this motherfucker bitches oh yeah that's so much better oh yeah comfy comfy fucking All right, y'all, that's gonna be the end of this video. If you'd like to see the updated gym tour or watch me test this new piece of equipment out with some heavy back training, as well as discuss what's coming next, check this video out right here. See you all in the next one.